we all had that moment where we were all ready to go out and at the last second finding that we forgot to charge our phone and it has like one percent of charge left when it comes to getting the most amount of charge in the least amount of time here are a couple of tips that can help you charge your device twice as fast This episode of Tech Quickies is brought to you by Zeus Smart USB Card Charger. If you want to charge up to two devices at full speeds while you're on the move, then definitely get the Zeus Charger. It automatically identifies your device and outputs just the right amount of charge your specific device needs for a faster charging experience. It also has this really cool car tracking option which will automatically remember where you have parked your car. So on your way back, you can easily locate your vehicle in style. Check the links in the description for more info. Now folks, the charging speeds has something to do with the charger that you're using. It basically depends on the watts and the amps value on the underside of your charger. Now different chargers has different power outputs. Most smartphone chargers can output anywhere from as low as 2.5 watts to all the way up to 10 watts, which means if you are using the charger from your old phone to charge your new phone, then it can take almost twice or sometimes even four times as longer than usual to charge your device. So it's always recommended to use the charger that came with your device or a charger with the equivalent power output. Closing all the background apps, then putting your device on flight mode, if not turning off all the wireless antennas, like Wi-Fi, the Bluetooth and the NFC will reduce the charge used in keeping the device alive, which will in turn significantly decrease the time it takes to charge your device. Here's a neat trick that you can use if you have no other option than charging your device off of a computer. Charging a device from a USB 3.0 port, the port with the blue color interiors, can charge your device surprisingly faster as the USB 3.0 port outputs around 40% more power than the USB 2.0 port as most computers these days come with both USB 2.0 as well as a USB 3.0 port so paying just a bit of attention while sticking the USB cable onto your computer will help charge your device much faster but probably the most quickest way to charge almost any smartphone out there drum roll please well the fastest way to charge your android device is simply by turning it off. Since Android devices and other smartphones are basically multitasking mini computers, they keep on running even when the phone is on idle or on sleep. So some of that charge that is going into your device is used by the device itself to run the background activities. Now if your device is completely turned off, all of that charge that is flowing through your charger goes straight into your battery, which based on my tests, can charge your phone twice as fast. I also noticed that while doing heavy multitasking, you know, doing things like playing games or even surfing the internet while the device is charging, it increases the device temperature, which may reduce the battery life, but also increases the charging time by up to 200%. And on some smartphones, especially the bigger ones, the battery percentage meter refused to increase or increased ever so slightly while using the device during charging. Although keeping your phone off is not the ideal way to charge your device, but when it comes to getting the most amount of charge in the least amount of time, this might be helpful. I guess that's about it. I'm your host HK from The Android Guy, signing out. And I hope you guys have a great day. Peace.